Well, we had an interesting night last night. Um, Penny woke up about two in the morning, which is not unusual. Uh, what was unusual was that after I put her down, about ten minutes later, she woke up and started being sick. You could hear the gurgle, so I ran in, tried to pick her up. There was sick all down my arm, my leg. Uh, you know, she she wasn't unwell in the sense of like she was feeling sorry for herself. She was just her normal self and then being sick, so you couldn't predict when she was, she'd got it all up. Um, you know, because sometimes once you get it all out of your system, you feel better. Three hours later, it was like five, half five in the morning and we're there just like, okay, we've really got to go to sleep now. <laughs> so we pretty much set on the fact that we weren't going to go for breakfast this, this morning. There was just no way we were going to get up. We, we decided to kind of stay in bed and sleep it off. And it's safe to say we're going to have a pretty lazy day today. Penny, are you feeling okay today? Yeah. Where did Robot go? I don't know. Did he get in there? Yeah. This is the first time we've been out all day. It's probably past lunchtime now. And we are looking for some bland food to help Penny's stomach. Um, again, so far, Mom. today she's been okay. Haven't you? You've been okay so far today. Back in the room again now, we're about to gorge ourselves on some food for a bit of a late lunch. Plan for the rest of the afternoon? I don't know, we might head to the beach, which is just like a short walk away. Um, but I think ultimately we'll be dictated on Penny and what maybe she feels she wants to do. Because she keeps wanting to go to the beach, so maybe we'll, maybe we'll go to the beach. It hasn't been a complete waste of a day. I've learned how to get to this beach. A nice, easy walk, and the sand looks lovely and soft. If only I had a beer. Oh, look at that. So you're probably wondering where Penny and Rachel are. They're back of the room. Um, Penny, as you know, hasn't been feeling 100%. So we had a, a pretty short dinner, relatively uh, without any issues. Just given the, the night that Penny had, Rachel stayed with Penny just to kind of put her to sleep. Me, as I am itching to kind of explore a little bit, I thought, you know what, I'll, I'll come for a little walk, see what's around. I do wish I had some more beers. I think this would be perfect. The beach, the sea, some drinks. Beautiful. Oh, and a beach fire. Got to have a beach fire. So, as you know, saw a hedgehog earlier. Went to the beach, spent some time there. I've come back and look who's still around. He still wasn't 100%, so we had another easy day and drove to Caleta de Fust for another beach trip. We have arrived in Caleta de Fust. Um, it's coming up to midday now, so we're gonna head to the town. By the, well, we're by the harbour now, so I'll probably go to the harbour, walk around to the beach. I gotta say, I'm quite impressed with this beach. I thought it would be really busy, and actually maybe in higher season it probably is, but there's tons of beds free, which is great for us. It's soft sand, it's a short walk down to the sea. My uncle's watching this, I'm sure, going, see, I told you, Dan, I told you, because he's been here so many times. 
Where are we, Penny? Yeah, on the beach. With what was to come later on in the trip, no spoilers, we did feel a little bit guilty dragging Penny around today after how she was feeling yesterday. We just took it easy and let her dictate what we did. Penny, what have you got there? <laughs> so we're in sunbathing for just over an hour. And we're getting itchy bums already. We're like, hmm, what can we do now? Penny's still not 100% from the other day. So we're trying to work out what the best thing to do is. We decided that the best thing to do was let her rest. So we journeyed back home. It's not until you get out of the shower that you realise where you burned. When you think you're thorough enough or that you've applied enough but even just having a backpack on your back <laughs> can just be enough to be able to see it here that's where I carried the backpack not a good look uh, but for now I'm on my last beer may end up buying some more we'll see time to enjoy the evening <laughs> 